Hello mga Matthusiast! Welcome back sa ating YouTube channel kung saan ang mat ay mas pinadadali at mas minamahal. At andito na naman si Teacher Maria ang inyong mat body para tulungan kayo sa mga problema nyo sa mat. And for today's video, ang pag-uusapan natin ay tungkol pa rin sa angles in a unit circle. Ha? Pero we are going to identify yung mga equivalent ng given natin. Okay? Pero bago ko simula ng video tutorial na ito, siguraduhin na munang napindot nyo na dyan ng like button. O, pindutin na. At syempre, kung bago ka pa lang sa aming YouTube channel, pindutin mo na rin dyan ng subscribe button. At ihit mo na rin ng notification bell para lagi kang maging updated sa mga videos na i-upload ko. Okay na, na like, na subscribe at na hit na rin ng notification bell. Kung okay na, tara na, simulan na natin. Okay, so for what is my equivalent? Number 1, express 42 degrees, 15, ah, sorry, mali ang symbol natin ha. <laughs> Nagkabaliktad. 15 minutes and 45 seconds in decimal form of a degree measure. So, i-convert natin to into decimal form. Paano ba yung gagawin natin? To have that, okay, so yung degrees, okay naman na siya. So, 42 degrees plus, dahil 15 minutes ito, kailangan ma-convert natin siya in degree. And in one minute or in one degree, there is a 60 minutes. So, this one will become 50 over 60. Okay? Plus, Okay, then ito ay seconds. In one degree, there are 3,600 seconds. Kaya ito ay magiging 45 over 3,600. Okay, and then pag na-add na natin yan, yan na yung decimal form niya. Okay, so para hindi na matagal to, gamit na tayo ng calculator mga anak ha. Kasi decimal number ang magiging answer natin dito. Okay, so... Oh, we have this one, ha? So, yung 42 degrees, copy lang, plus what is 15 divided by 60. We have here 15 divided by 60. That is 0.25. So, we have here 0.25 plus yung 45, divide nyo lang siya by 3,600, ha? Okay, so we have here... 45 divided by 3,600. So, that's 0.0125. 0.0125. Ulit ha, saan nakuha yung 60? Kasi in 1 degree, there is 60 minutes. Okay? Tapos, dahil nga 60 men... Men eh. Minutes meron ka, sorry. Dahil 60 minutes nga meron ka, at alam mo na sa 1 minute, there are 60 seconds, imumultiply mo yung 60 by 60. So, we have 006 times 6, 3,600. Kaya nakuha natin to ha? And then, we add. So, we have here 42 plus... 0.25 plus 0.0125. And that is 42.2625. Okay, 42.2625 degrees. Okay, or i-round off, na off na natin to the nearest hundreds. So, that's 42.26. Degrees. So, ganun lang siya kadali, mga anak ha. Okay, number 2. Express 121.56 in degree minutes second measure. So, yung kabaliktaran nung ginawa natin sa number 1, yun yung gagawin natin dito. So, sisiw lang to, mga anak ko. Yung 121, okay na yan. Okay, 121 degree. Ngayon, etong decimal number, yung i-convert natin in minutes. O, in minutes muna tayo ha. So, 0.56 minutes. Okay. So, ita-times natin siya. Ay, sorry. 
i-convert pa lang pala natin siya in minutes. So, so that's 56 degree. Point 56 degree. So, point 56 degree times, alam naman natin na sa 1 degree, there are 60 minutes. Yun, in-explain ko kanina dito sa conversion, ba diba? In 1 degree, there are 60 minutes. So, i-multiply nyo lang siya. Cancel to, cancel. So, point 56 times 60. So, let's have this one, 0.56 times 60, and that's 33.6. So, we have here, ter wait, 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 33.6 minutes. Okay, and then, kailangan na natin yung seconds. Okay, dahil ito ay 0.6 na lang naman yung decimal natin dyan. So, we have 0.6 times... In one minute, ilang seconds meron tayo? We have 60 seconds. Ito, minute to, ba? Diba? So, cancel to cancel. So, 0.6 times 60, we have 0.6 times 60. We have 36. So, we have 36 36 seconds. So, our final answer will be 121 degrees, 33 minutes, and 36 seconds. Yung mga whole number lang ha, hindi kasama yung decimal. So, ulit, we have 121 degrees. Ito yung whole number kanina. Yung 0.56 naging 33.6. So, kukunin lang natin yung whole number. So, that's 33 minutes. And then, yung 0.6 na convert natin into seconds. Kaya, 36 na siya. 36 seconds. So, this is our final answer. Now, for number 3, convert 25 degrees into radian measure. So, 25 degrees times, ano yun? Uh, times pi over 180 degrees. So, cancel to, cancel to. Pwede natin ma-lowest term, di ba? So, this is divisible by 5. So, 5 and then 180 divided by 5. We have here, ilan to? 3. We have 15, 36. Uh, so, we have here 36. Uh, so, over 1 to 5 times a 5 is a 5 pi over 36 rad. Okay? For number 4, we have to convert negative 5 pi over 20 rad to degree measure. So, we have here negative 5 pi over 20. Okay, ito times natin siya with 180 degrees over pi. So, cancel natin ito. We will have how many? We will have, ah, uh, ito, pwede natin silang ma-lowest term. So, you will have here 1 and then this one is 9 na lang siya, ba? Diba? So, negative 5 times 9, that's negative 45 degrees. So, ibig sabihin, yung 5 pi over, or yung negative 5 pi, oh, negative 5 pi over 20 is equal to negative 45 degrees. Now, for number 5, convert 5 rad to degree, minute, second measure. So, paano ba natin gagawin to? Wala siyang pi, ha? So, we have here pi rad. Imumultiply natin siya with... Uh, 180 pi rad. Okay? Kasi walang pi dyan eh. So, ang makakancel lang natin dito, yung radian measure natin. So, magiging uh, 5 times 180 and that is 900. Tama ba? 180 times 5. 0, 40 carry 4, 5 plus 4. So, 900. So, we have 900 over pi. At alam naman natin yung pi ay 3.14, di ba? So, 900 divided by 3.14. Para makuha natin yung decimal number, ha? So, we have here, syempre, i-calculator na natin yan para mabilis. 900 divided by 3.14. So, that's 286.14. 62 na lang. Round off na natin, ha? 286.62. 286.62. And then, saka na natin siya i-convert. Naalala yung ginawa natin kanina sa number 
So, degrees ito, ba? Diba? So, si 286 degrees, okay na siya. Yung 0.62, i-convert muna natin siya in minutes. So, times, dahil ito ay degrees, in 1 degree, there is 60 minutes. Excuse me. Cancel to, cancel to. So, 0.62 times 60. We have there 0.62 times 60. And that is 37.2. So, 37.2. Meron na tayong minutes. Itong 0.2 kailangan i-convert natin into seconds. So, 0.2 times in 1 minute. Dahil minute to. There is 60 seconds. Oh, so, cancel to, cancel to. So, 0.2 times 60. That is 0.2 times 60. That is 12. Okay, so we have 12 seconds. Ito minute, ito degree. So, our final answer will be 286 degrees, 37 minutes. Sorry. 37 minutes dapat isa lang. And 12 seconds. So, 286, 37, and 12. Okay. So, this is it. Ngayon, kung nagustuhan mo ang video na ito, please i-comment yan sa ating comment section ha. Mga anak ko, ang mga comments ninyo ay mahalaga para maapang video na ito at makita din naman siya ng iba. Kaya please sana sa lahat ng video ni Teacher Maria ay magko-comment kayo. Okay? At please visit our Facebook page, Love Ma TV. Sige na mga anak, i-follow nyo na itong page natin ha. And pa-share na agad-agad to sa mga classmates ninyo. Laging tandaan, let's spread the love of math. Thank you and bye!